hi guys welcome to my channel today we will discuss how to draw an inclined line using an autocad software in my pc autocad 2000 version is already installed and if you don't have the software you can download it from autodesk web page uh, by browsing through google search engine so here by in my system uh, this autocad 2000 version which is an outdated one it's being already installed so now let's see how we can draw an inclined line using this software okay so in order to draw an inclined line first you need to draw line command and the short form of line command is expressed as l so you will have to press l button on your keyboard so i am pressing l after pressing l you will have to enter then you can see the cursor uh, like this so you can um, click any uh, on any portion of the uh, this window so i am clicking out here after that you can see your line is being generated now you need to fix the dimensions of the line and the angle okay since you need to have an inclined line no so for that you will have to press shift and add button together after uh, uh, after pressing both shift button and uh, add button on your keyboard together you will have to specify the dimension of the line which you may require so here i need the dimension of the line to be 125 mm so i am giving 125 mm then again after that you will have to press shift and less than button on your keyboard after pressing these two buttons together then you will have to specify the angle suppose let's assume i need an angle to be i need this angle and this inclined line to be at 65 degree from baseline so okay so i am giving 65 after that you have to give enter now you have to press escape from exit from this command so now you can see your inclined line has been generated so now you can check the dimension as well as the angle uh, by going to the dimension tab so before that uh, let's assume a baseline okay so for that i am again pressing l button which is line command again i am pressing enter then I am clicking over this portion. So I am making it straight. So now I need to ensure the dimension of the line as well as the angle which I had given in the command is, is being generated as per my request. So in order to uh, ensure that you need to go to dimension tab. You can go to angular dimension. So after that you can click the lines wherein you need to check the angle so here i need to check the angle between these two lines so i am clicking out here and here now you can see i had already specified 65 degree angle so my requirement has been fulfilled so now again you have to check the dimension of the line so for that you need to go dimension tab again you need to go for this align command align uh, dimension click this after that you have to specify the two points wherein you need to have the dimension you need to check the dimension so these are my two points i am checking out here and again i am clicking out here so now you can see the dimension so as i as i said in my command before i had specified line of the length 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 of the line as 125 mm so now it's been uh, confirmed that the inclined line has been generated as per my requirement okay now let's see we need to draft an inclined line which is of mm, which is of opposite to this portion i mean like a mirror image of this one. so for that you need to give minus 65 degree okay now again i am giving line line command uh, and the short form of short form of line command is l uh, press l keyboard on your uh, key l button on your keyboard then enter again click uh, your cursor on any portion of the window now again i am giving the dimension of the line that is i'll have to press shift and add button together then now, now i am giving line dimension as uh, 55 now again i'll have to press shift and less than button together and now i'll have to specify the angle my now i am going to give minus 65 degree then you have to enter Now you can see the inclined line has been generated in the opposite direction which is the mirror image of this one. So this is 65 degree that, that is 65 degree. 
now this is the mirror i had given minus 65 so this is this will be this, this is on the mirror side of this uh, baseline so now again you can check this by click uh, going to dimension tab click angular dimension click these two points you can check this is a 65 degree which is the mirror image mirror image of this line okay now again you can check the uh, dimension so for that you need to go to this align click over here select two points of the line where you need to get the dimension click over here then you can stretch it and hold it over here so now you can see the dimension of 55 this is what i have specified in the command before drafting so likewise you can go for drafting incline line uh, by using this command okay so what you have to do is that you, uh, in order to adapt an incline line you have to first press line command uh, short form which is l and uh, after uh, pressing l l button on your keyboard you have to press enter after that you have to um, press shift and add button together on your keyboard and then you have to specify the dimension of the line and again you have to press shift and less than button together on your keyboard and then again you have to specify the uh, angle angle of angle for the line okay so likewise you can generate an inclined line using this autocad software so friends today that's all and i'll be coming again with more videos so if you find it useful please do like share and uh, give your comments and i'll be happy to assist you always hope you might have enjoyed this uh, video session Thank you so much for watching.